Hey guys, welcome back to another video today. I'm going to be sharing the best Town 16 bases that I've been using in the bus in the past month. Now I know I haven't been uploading for a while, like maybe two days. It's been a very, very busy week for me. And it's going to be like that for a couple of days extra, just because I'm, I've been handling some stuff. But in the next week, I'll be uploading daily, hopefully. Anyways, let's just get right into the bases. Okay, he is base number one. Now this base is actually one of, this is my favorite base to defend super witches. And basically fireball attacks like if the attacker if the attacker does nothing wrong then I don't think any base can handle like can handle that but in this in this base it's especially like if the attacker fireballs the eagle which is a very very vulnerable area for the fireball and it enters from this area I feel like the attacker will fail like maybe 75% of the time I've been using this uh, base in esports and it's basically defending one out of every two times and that's insanely good and yeah, this especially this monolith area is kind of deadly because these compartments make your make the heroes go around and everything. And the king right here also protects the monolith kind of. This town compartment with everything in the core. Look at this. This this is like really annoying core. Double poison right here as well. And yeah, one flaw of the space would be like it's all ground expos and then any air, like any air troop would basically have a free, free time at the eagle. So you might want to modify that place. But look at this. This Tesla farm, it, it basically baits everybody. Everyone attacks from the bottom and then goes at that Tesla farm and it kind of destroys them at the end. So that's that's literally one of the reasons why people fail in this base. So this is base number one. I'll be having that in the description. If you want to have it, you can definitely have that. Okay, he is base number two. Now this one is a little bit, is a little bit like... Okay, so he's base number two. This one is also similar to the first base. It also depend the the basically trying to defend fireball super witches, and these uh this eagle right here is kind of unconventional, like usually you have the eagle, kind of like unprotected, but in this case if the attacker goes fireball like right here and then opposite side the eagle will keep shooting it down on the super witches and hopefully slowing them slowing them down and eventually it will end up in a fail. This is the second base. If you want to copy it, it'll be linked in the description. Okay, this is the third base. Now this base actually. I've been doing some testing and I've actually kind of failed on it a couple times just because this compartment at the end, the CC, if the attacker with the fireball super which is approaches right here and then goes from the opposite side, that back end kind of ruins him with that CC, especially the tunnel poison. If we go through the tunnel poison with everything on there, everything just dies. That's what I've realized. These red air bombs as well, they, they kind of catch the healers so that the, the super witches don't heal when they're on the town hall, which is kind of great. You might want to know that all these bases I've been using to test out armies in my past videos and these bases have all been working really well for me especially in esports and people that don't know what they're doing so this is the third base if you want to copy it you'll be linked down in the description okay now let's get on to the bases that that try to defend lava loons now i'm not saying i know lava loons are going to be gone in like two days but the bases are still good for basically anything this base especially has been, has been defending dragons for a lot during the past month because people still run dragons for some reason with the event. Um, so if they miss that, air, uh, what's it called? If they miss the air sweeper and the blimp goes on the NATO, basically you can't get that blimp to the town hall. And then they bait dragons really, really well. So if you wanna, if you're attacking about, if you're getting attacked by dragons a lot, um, consider using this base. I'll have the the a different, like a different trapped version because this trap is for meant to be for lava loons. So I'll have the different trapped version. In the description you don't have to worry about this one i'll actually show you a picture right now okay so this is the base right here before the lava loon modifications this is the base you'll be getting when you copy it down below my friend is actually the one who modified the space so shout big shout out to bunch he's uh my good friend he's the one who actually modified the space and trapped it so go subscribe to him he's on youtube his, his youtube channel is bunch clash of clans or coc i think so yeah let's get to the next space okay here's the next space this one was also built for Lava Loons, but it also defends a lot of spam armies like Root Riders. So if you want to run this one, this might actually defend Root Riders in Legend League. If, you, if, if you're still getting attacked by Root Riders, I don't know who still gets, gets attacked by Root Riders. But if you are, then you can use this base. It's pretty good and it will also be linked in the description. Okay, here's another base. This one also, Root Riders and Dragons, it defends them pretty well. It's mainly this compartment right here, the CC in the Monolith compartment. And look at those Teslas. If the heroes go there or any root riders step on that area, they're basically gone. So this base is pretty decent. I, I like it. It has a lot of compartments 
like people c can mess up with the super witches there's not too much fireball value i wouldn't say there's much fireball value except maybe the expo that is the same value that right, right there okay he's another base again all most of these bases were modified for lava loons but this can also work for dragons if you're getting attacked by dragons this has a weird like weird compartment and a weird like void area in the middle so yeah you might want to switch those air sweepers to be facing the opposite side just uh let's actually do that right now just like this and just like nope and like that that looks pretty good and yeah that should be all the bases and obviously one of the bases is here on my layout and if you enjoyed the, the the video and copied any of the bases let me know how it goes for you comment that down below like subscribe to the video all that good stuff and i'm sorry guys for not uploading that much i'll hopefully be uploading, uploading more next week and i'll see you guys in the next one bye bye